That was my cherry popping. Okay. Hello, sweetness. How are you today? I'm fantastic. So, y'all, sometimes I just crave the cherry. I got a taste for the cherry. I just need to eat that pussy. <laughs> y'all, today I'm making giant jelly cherries. I'm so excited. I want to make it look like the emoji where there's two cherries and little stems and shit. I think it's going to be really fun. I'm really excited to make it. But before we get started, don't forget to hit that subscribe button right there to become a tomato. We're trying to reach 1.5 million tomatoes. So hit that subscribe button right Right there it's red like a cherry also give this video a thumbs up let's try to reach 30,000 thumbs ups also last thing this video is part of a giant DIY collaboration like massive and we're all doing really fun ideas like literally so many people it's epic <laughs> the people that I'm collabing with are my boyfriend Alejandro Valdez yeah Zani Loie from Loie Lane Natalie from Natalie's Outlet Chrissy from Glamour Life Fox Breland from Glitter Forever 17, Clarissa from Clarissa May, and Rosalie from Rosalie Says Rawr. All their links will be below. Go subscribe to all of them. Go watch their videos. Tell them tomato sent you. Put a little tomato emoji. Okay, y'all, let's get started. Okay, so first up, I added some water to a pot. Yes, that's water in a Sprite bottle. It was convenient. I used it. I then added four packets of cherry jello. It looks like a heavy flow today, y'all. Then I added two bottles of genuine cherry juice. This is a real ass bitch, y'all, not a fake ass bitch. And why is cherry juice so expensive, by the way? I haven't bought it before. I was like, holy shit. Is there gold in there is there a damn mona lisa painting hiding in this bottle why is it so expensive so as you can see i added a lot of extra gelatin just to make sure it was firm and gummy texture and then i added <laughs> i keep adding shit y'all holy shit this is a long list i added frosting to first of all for flavor of course and to give it a bright beautiful color brighter than your grandfather's anus in 1960 i don't know what that meant but i just added food coloring to make it redder and now i'm cooking it as you can see it was like a piece the sauce texture and then turned soupier and now it's completely liquid that's what we want we want that liquid shit i put it on my sprite bottle and now i'm gonna put it into balloon so it's like a circular mold i blew up the balloon i attached it to the soda bottle and then i just poured it in and i did this twice because i made two cherries but y'all trying to tie the balloon with the liquid inside is probably the most stressful thing you will ever go through in your life you can't let it leak or like it'll get all slippery and then you can't tie it because it's slippery and then shit happens like y'all Oh, shit goes wrong. But it's okay when stuff like that happens, you just try again and again. Oh my, oh my god, god, my cherry papa. Oh my god, did you guys see that explosion? I literally could not go on. I had to like just stop filming and go to the kitchen and finish it up, but luckily I did. These are the hardened cherries in the balloons. I did it. But y'all, it exploded all over my sister's room. I literally had a freak out and I was like running around cleaning everything, cleaning her floor. Yo, her bed looks like it has a big period on it. Oh my god. This needs a DIY tampon. Bring it in. <laughs> Where are you, girl? We need you. And now the final step of the DIY is to make the stems. And so I'm going to make them out of, um, I think they're called pipe cleaners. These are not edible, so if you're going to eat the cherries, take this shit out first. So I'm going to take a bunch of them and, like, kind of wrap them around each other. Twist them, twist them. Twist my cherry. Actually, that sounds painful. <laughs> Ow. <laughs> okay, we have like two cherry stems. Let's open these bitches up, y'all. First of all, I think these are also part-time titties. Okay, let's open. Ah! Oh my god. <laughs> That's a nipple. <laughs> the color's kind of odd. The bottom's really pretty. Oh fuck, what's happening here? What is that? What? is this my jelly tomato turned out so perfect wait let me cut off the nipple i'm sorry i need to i hope this one turned out a little better oh so this one's a little flat this one's got an areola not as nice as i thought they would turn out but let's add the stems oh now let's twist these shits together y'all okay it's not bad cherries yeah from a distance they look so much better but when you get up close it's like oh. i'm excited to taste them don't always judge a book by its fucking ugly cover <laughs> okay 
If it didn't have that much gelatin, it would taste really good, but I'm just one of those people that like adds more and more gelatin just in case if it's not enough. So I always add too much <laughs> and it always tastes like shit. Well, that was so much fun. Did y'all see my last video? I made a big edible hairbrush and that one turned out a lot prettier than this. Don't forget to check out everyone else in this collab and don't forget to subscribe to become a tomato. Uh, I love you guys so much. I'll see you next video. Ooh, boo, boo.